Hello, in this video we're going to be looking at creating a spiral in Fusion 360. There are different ways to do this, but I'm going to show you what I think is the easiest way. So we go to create and we're going to select coil. We um, It might ask you to select a plane, mine was already selected, um, but then you draw your the diameter of your, your largest part of the coil. I'm going to go 100 mil and right now it's um, a coil it's got it's vertical and we want it to be flat a flat spiral so we go over to the coil preferences and the coil um, options and the type we're going to change to spiral and that changes it into a flat object okay now depending on what your you want yours to look like uh, that might be right but you can change all the different uh, parameters on the side here make it have more coils revolutions you can change the uh, cross section of the the shape of the cross section and you can also set it to start on the external um, outside of the the diameter that you selected um, so what we've got here section size I'm going to change this section size to 10 mil and you can see that the cross section area changes and um, if you're happy with that you can stop watching the video now but I needed to use this spiral to create a torsion spring um, a custom torsion spring so um, I created it like this but it needs some kind of lugs on the end of it to locate it uh, in the center and on the outside so I'm going to show you how to go ahead and do that I'm going to select this face and press create sketch and I'm going to put a rectangle in here okay and I'm also going to put a rectangle at the other side let's put it up here like that and I'm simply going to extrude this the same height as my coil okay so I can't remember my the height of my coil right now but we'll we'll work it out so let's extrude it 2 mil so that's obviously not enough and if we want it to be minus 2 mil was it 20 mil too far 10 mil okay there we go so there we go I've created my torsion spring um, I've been testing these with a 3d printer and they seem to work pretty well so um, maybe I'll update you with that uh, very soon thanks for watching